what's up guys we're heading to an interesting one tonight there's a uh, trailer over near the uh, intersection of 521 and county road 56 in the rocheron area it apparently i i think uh it looks like an axle or two of both axles are twisted out from underneath it has multiple flats um they said it's kind of in a ditch so we uh are heading over there to see what we got i don't know how there's gonna be winching involved or it's really gonna just idiot. drag it straight up the uh up the bed or what so it's loaded with lawn equipment it looks like from the pictures uh, they're concerned with it sliding off into the ditch so we uh head that way we'll see what we got in a little bit thanks for watching guys all right, so we're pulling up here. And then heard on the scanner that this, there's a trooper here now, and uh, it sounds like they it was actually involved in an accident. The uh, and they called the wrecker for the other vehicle, and uh, we're picking up the trailer here. I'm gonna see it's right there. is leaning pretty bad it looks like so I don't know exactly what we're gonna have to do to get it righted Let me pull up here What's up guys? Alright. I'll hang around for a little bit while they get it right. Thank you. So it's still attached to your truck, right? Yeah. Okay. We were gonna And uh, you won't need any paperwork for me, sir, so when you get it loaded up. Good to go. Appreciate it. Okay. Where'd the other axle go? It broke off, man. It broke off? Yeah, we have it loaded up here. Okay, it's and already... Yeah, the other one's dragged all the way back here. Where you yeah, that's that what I've seen. I wasn't sure how stable it was going to be. If, yeah, if I could... Uh, I was hoping it would be pretty stable. Otherwise, I can chain it chain it in place. But it looks like it's kind of jammed under there. Um, I'm thinking... We tried Sim moving it, but it was just falling. It's just going to keep, yeah, it's yeah. going to keep sliding down. I'm thinking about turning back around and pulling it back up onto the road. Because uh, if I go to start winching it up, I don't even know if we could get it off of your ball like it is right now. Uh, if I go to start pulling it, it's liable to just keep on going down the ditch and there's that culvert and stuff right there in front of it. I really don't want to get it in. If that wasn't there, I wouldn't, I would probably just try to get it up, but I'm thinking about trying to get the back into the trailer up first. Um, so let me uh, tell the trooper what I'm going to do here real quick. And uh, I'm going to turn around. I'll probably pull up right here. I guess that's one of y'all's trucks yeah, there. You need me to move if you could back it up just a little bit more, just to give me enough room to kind of snake in here, gotcha. that would work. All right. Yeah, give me a second. Yes, I'm going to try to get the, uh, the back end of that trailer up some. Uh -huh. um, so I might need to be a little bit in the lane or right on the edge of the lane. Okay. If you don't mind, at least kind of about half the lane I'll, I'll probably need. 
Okay. Um, yeah, I figured that's why I'm gonna hang out in I, I, I appreciate you that. You'll be able to load that up. Oh yeah, I can load it. I just I'm I don't think I can get it off his ball where it's at, and with that culvert being right there, okay. it's just gonna drag right through that culvert. So I'm gonna try to get it up first. Okay. So let me I'm gonna turn around real quick. Oh yeah, that's plenty. That's plenty space right there. All right. How the uh, ball of that trailer is twisted on the hitch there. I don't think we could get it off there and can get it loaded without it really uh, fighting us. So I'm going to try to winch the trailer back up on the road. That way, everything is uh, more in line. from here, except for some of these verticals. This will go to right, right there. You go ahead and step away there. Why don't you step back just in case this cable or something lets go. I don't want you to get caught by it.
how much is that hitch looking better there? Yeah, a lot better. Okay. Sure. If uh, oh. do you have a jack for it or? Yeah, we got this one. Okay. Here. Yeah, go ahead. It? Yeah, it should it should be stable now. It's uh should be able to get off of there. Lifting up on the truck. Yeah. Mid uh sorry. God dang. Yeah, it's not gonna go anymore. Okay. Um let me bring it down again and redo it. Maybe it just stayed locked. It looks like it's got a lot of have you maybe try backing the truck up a little bit? Alex! Hey! Dale para atrás bien poquitito! See how much strain there was on that? All right, hold that. Oh. No, that's all it's gonna do. It's not picking up anymore. Yeah, it's got some. There, there it goes. Go. Still under it just a little bit. You wanna jump on it while he moves it forward? Yeah. Go forward really slow. There, there we go. There you go. Uh, go ahead and pull this one. Go ahead and pull up and just give me enough room to get my truck okay. in right here. Let me get turned around again. We got trailer free of the truck now. Make sure we're good on traffic. And then we can get this thing loaded up.
Yeah, I stay there in, in Richwood. Our uh, office is based out of Angleton. So that's where I'm at. Your number around next time, friend. Yeah, yes, that's that number that I was calling you from. That's yeah. that's my number. So, if you ever need anything, just let me know. Get my bed past them little loops. And then go ahead and uh, get that jack. Okay, gotcha. Back up. Just enough for me to get my, my bed under it there. really what I wanted to do right here kind of walk my bed under it but with it being at that angle I just didn't see that really being a, a possibility no way. it would have kept wanting to go off that's a deep culvert right there Let's see what it does now This this side axle is. If I'm correct, it should be right about right here. Well, I just want to make sure everything's like in line to get up on the oh, on the bed because I can straighten it up once it's on the bed. I'll uh, probably gonna try to keep coming with it there because I can always straighten it up once I get it up.
Yeah, it's it's going that way. It, it's going to. There ain't there ain't nothing we can do about it. Let me uh, fix myself just a little bit here. I'm about to run out of headroom. With my uh, winch, really I can't even do that. about as far up as I can get it let me get a uh, one of my skates under it there and then I can slide the whole thing over out of there? Um, shouldn't. Okay. Well, I might need one more chain, okay. but uh, I'll need I'll need that in a minute. For now, this will do. I get it's a it's a, a particular chain that I need. About I'll, I'll get it in a minute. Once it kind of depends on how this comes up. Yeah, I got you.
that all I got. Ooh. I think that's about as centered as I'm gonna get it there. I'm out of headroom there. believe if I said this probably wasn't the worst one that I've seen. Oh man, I thought this was pretty bad. <laughs> it's pretty bad, but it's not the worst. I'm just glad there was room and I was able to get it slid back up. Otherwise that would have that would have sucked a little bit but So it had like a tire just like blue and it took out the axles or? It was a car on the side of the road. This oh. dude didn't see it and you know, it just barely clipped it and you know, fucked it. Took, took out that whole corner? Yeah, I gotta, I'm gonna throw another strap here on the back. Okay. So it's got that one chain pulling it this way, but I want to go the other way with it too. Okay, okay. That way it's not wanting to uh, go anywhere. I'll be behind you anyways. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Especially on trailers, I like to have multiple points pulling on it. That's pretty good there. Um, yeah, and then uh, head to that address that you texted me. Yeah, earlier. I'll be following you. Tempo. All right. So we got this thing loaded up. Bags and everything are up. I'm going to be heading to the customer's place to get it dropped off. And we'll be uh, over there here shortly. Thanks for watching, guys. Alright, so we are backing up towards the uh, customer's shop here where he wants it dropped off. ride over. Yeah, strap off the 
this side here. I'll throw it here for now. I'm gonna try to let loose on the winch a little bit, so I'm gonna it might move just a little bit here. I mean, you can't. I'm just gonna set it down and put my truck out from underneath it. So it should be, it should be okay. I'm gonna have to lay it down more. Hmm? You want to put the the jack down so it'll just slide down? And once I get on the ground, that'll that'll touch down, and then it'll it'll slide off. Okay, okay. It'll be, and then I'll lift. I'll, how we how we did it out there? Okay. I'll lift it up, and then we can put the jack down, and then it'll be okay, sitting there. That way, that way it's it's up, you know. Yeah, I know. I gotta get it loose. Okay. Gotta get the trailer to hang first. Now I can get my chain off of it. side first.
push my truck forward. Go ahead and uh, lower the, uh, you need the jack down. Yeah, lower the jack down now. All right. Good there. Gonna. What is the right side? Oh, that is, that's all the glue. Oh, down. Yeah, you probably have to. Good. I can always, I can set it down too if I need to. too much of an issue. Of course being right there on the edge of the roadway it was gonna pretty much fight us regardless so we uh, headed back to the house. We'll see you uh, whatever comes next. Appreciate you guys for watching. If y'all would please subscribe, like, and share.